Hi and welcome back to another video from OCD Review. Today I have a Bluetooth speaker in front of me from a company called S Bode. And this particular model is the M400. So here's the box. And if we flip around, we can actually see there's a tons of functions going on in here. It has the ability to pair two of them so you can build a surround sound with left and right and having a stereo going on in your house. It's also rated IPS6 water resistant. A 22 milliamp rechargeable battery for up to eight hours of listening. Built-in microphone for hands-free call. Aux jack if you don't want to use Bluetooth. FM radio and SD card mode. And this is a quick look from the side of the box. So the box has a pull tab just like all the JBL speaker and it opens like so. Inside of here we got a plastic tab to protect the speaker and the M400 just sits in the middle of this. As we pull the bottom part of the plastic, the accessory bag includes a manual, an auxiliary cable, and a flat noodle style micro USB charging cable. And here's the speaker itself. As you can see, the speaker is made out of this cloth material, very ragged design. And if the speaker ever gets dirty, you can actually wash it with running water. On the back of the speaker, you got a whole bunch of buttons. They're all flat to the surface. This makes it very easy to grab. And on the top, we have the power slash mult changing button, Bluetooth pairing answering the calls, play pause, plus and minus are for skipping the song or adjusting volume. And the last button is the party mode to pair up another device if you want to use left and right stereo mode. There's also a water resistant access port right here. As we pull that off, you can see the SD card port, the micro USB charging port, and the aux port. Also on the side of these buttons, there are four indicators for battery levels. A lanyard is also included for carrying and hanging. The speaker has two main drivers inside of this and two passive radiators on both sides as well. It is not a 360 degree sounding speaker, so you do have to turn the speaker towards you if you're listening. You can place the speaker horizontally like this or vertically. All right, and let's get right into the in-depth review. And let's start with the pros first. The speaker has a very sturdy built quality. It has this smooth cylinder shape all the way around and all the buttons on the speakers are flat to the touch. The water resistant tap can be fully open. This gives you great space to access all the port when needed. I actually found frustrating with a lot of the JBL speakers, the port don't fully open, especially like the Charge 3 and the Extreme. This M400 tab can be fully twisted to another direction and I find it really easy to access all my ports. Upon turning on the speaker, it does remember the volume settings since the last use. And not just in Bluetooth, but in all modes. This is a nice feature, a lot of the speakers don't. Especially on FM and SD card mode, it always starts full volume, but this one does remember volume for all modes. And FM mode is always the extra feature, which is nice. On top of that, the speaker has super clear FM signal. Even inside a house, without aux cable attachment needed, you can actually hear the station clearly. Again, I've seen a lot of speakers and even cell phone that actually requires either a headphone or a aux cable in order to act as FM and to receive clear signal. For this model, you don't need that. The default sound signature of the speaker has a very flat yet very balanced EQ setting. It gives you a nice neutral sound, just like the JBL Flip 4. The bass is pretty strong for the size, and if you want, you can even push the EQ setting on your phone to get more bass out of this little thing without too much distortion at all. Another cool thing, the unit actually shuts off automatically after around 20 to 30 minutes on idle. This is great for battery saving. So if you ever forgot to turn off your speaker, you don't have to worry about that. The M400 offers full voice prompt throughout all the settings. It will tell you which mode you're on and even tells you if your battery is low. And here's a little demo. Power on, pairing, Bluetooth mode, device paired, FM radio mode, aux in mode, device disconnected, power off. I think this model really competes with the JBL flip line. It offers way more functions at a lower price. So if you don't care about the brand, you should definitely check out the s M400. The speaker is actually really nice all the way around, so there's really not much but one problem I found. At max volume, it doesn't get extremely loud. I compared that with my JBL Flip 4 side by side. If you set both speaker at full volume, the JBL 4 does get louder than the M400, but the M400 has no distortion at max volume though. It is ideal for a small to a medium sized room. But if you decide to pair two of them, you should be able to hold a party without any problem. And here's a little sound demo for you guys.
As a conclusion, I really do enjoy using this S-Build M400 speaker. I found myself using the speaker at shower all the time, and it sounds every bit as good as the JBL speakers. As if right now you can get the speaker for only $69.99 on Amazon. I would certainly recommend getting it, and you have a lot of functions all in one package. The M400 offers very nice built quality and nice high fidelity sound signature. I would think this is an awesome deal if you need one Bluetooth speaker as your daily driver. The Espo M400 will certainly do the job, and you'll be very happy with it. I'll throw a purchase link in the description down below, and they're currently available on Amazon.com. Like, comment, and subscribe as usual, and I will see you in the next one.